We all know that Drake is the best <clears throat> rapper of all time. And recently he came out with a music video that's a little questionable, a little creepy, but does bring up an interesting discussion. Now he has uh, a song, a single I should say, from his latest mixtape. He didn't like to call it an album. And it's called Energy, right? Where he talks about how he's got a lot of enemies trying to drain him of his energy, right? And he parodies a bunch of huge celebrities, including Justin Bieber, Miley Cyrus, President Barack Obama, Oprah Winfrey. And he's trying to make a point about all of these A-listers and how they have to deal with naysayers, people who oppose them, people who don't like them, people who write some pretty hideous things about them. Now, here are some examples of Drake basically taking on the appearances of <laughs> many different people. There's, there he is trying to be Barack Obama. <laughs> And then you saw the Oprah That's one, the which is the most <laughs> awkward one, if you ask me. Others question. include O.J. Simpson and LeBron James. <clears throat> one line from his song is, all right, I got enemies, got a lot of enemies, got a lot of people trying to drain me of this energy. By the way, you guys should check out this mixtape because I loved it. It's really good. <laughs> anyway, um, I thought that it was amusing. I watched it. It was a little creepy. I love the song. Mm -hmm. But what do you guys think about this? Do you think this was a, a smart marketing move in terms of getting people to talk about his music? Melia. I absolutely think it's a smart marketing move. And I think he and Justin Timberlake both love doing characters and sketches. Right. I would love for them to have a variety show together, right. you know? But, um, I, you know, in terms of having enemies, I mean, he's black and Jewish. It comes with the territory, <laughs> mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> like, you know, that's, I, I've never heard anyone articulate that point as well as you just did, but it's true. I mean, black and Jewish, two groups that have been persecuted for a very, very long time, not just in the United States, but throughout the yeah, world, right. yeah. Drew, what do you think? Make your point. Um, I think it's hilarious. I also think of uh, Eminem. He does a lot of parodies. He used to mm -hmm. make fun of a lot yeah. of people that would like, it was more like you'd make fun of them instead of act like them, but, it, right. he, but it's still, still funny to me when I see the video. Um, I mean, he's gonna have enemies. I mean, celebrity is comes with the yeah. comes with the territory. Don't don't be famous then. That's I feel thing. like <laughs> right. if you don't have enemies, then you're not really right. doing it's anything true. right. If you right. don't like it, then stop and then quit, and you don't have to do it anymore. So. Exactly, very true. <clears throat> now, if you could be a celebrity for a day, which celebrity would you be, Melia? Buddha. Buddha. I would love to just be zenned out, peaceful, in a meditative state for an entire day. All right, fair enough, <laughs> Drew. What about you? Uh, you have her. Period. <laughs> okay, all right, so, someone's got that libido going, My got it. <laughs> all right, all right. I don't, you know, I actually don't want to be any celebrity. I'm not mm -hmm. tempted by any of it. Right. I think being a celebrity is actually pretty disastrous because you, you don't get any privacy, you can't live your life, you can't do what you really want to do. But if it had to be for a day and I had to choose, I think I would probably go with Caitlyn Jenner just to see what it's really like to be her, right? Because, of course, there is a lot of courage in what she did, and I'm curious to see how people react to her when she's out in public, because we only get a little bit of it. Snippet. Mm -hmm. We get snippets of how people react to her. And truthfully, we're all kind of many celebrities in a way with all the social platforms, For Periscope, sure. Vine, you that's know, true, everything. That's so true, that's true. You have, yeah. your, you have you, your fans and, that love you. And you still be able to, like, you know, he's, you know, he's still got his... You can still see it. You can. Oh. Never mind. You want a hybrid no, human no. hair, Caitlyn Jenner? <laughs> That's true. Then I can finally see what it's like to have, you know, different kibbles and bits down there. There you go. I see? I can explore with. <laughs> anyway. All right, guys, tell us what you think. If you could be a celebrity for a day, who would you be? Do you agree with me that Drake is the best rapper of all time? I don't really think that, but I do really like Drake. And also, what do you think of his music video? Have you seen it? Do you think it's creepy? Do you think it's clever? Comment in the section below, share your thoughts, and we'll see you soon.